I've now been nominated five times for an Emmy, which is like unbelievable, can't believe it. But every, and I've never won, but every single time I'm sitting at the award show in my dress, in my in unbelievably uncomfortable high-heeled shoes, and I'm sitting there, and the long, the, as I'm sitting there and they're announcing my category, without fail, I'm always like, don't let it be me, don't let it be me. I cannot walk up there in these shoes. No, I mean, I'm going to fall. It's so funny. When it comes right down to that moment, I'm like, no, I can't do it, I can't do it. Really my favorite part of what I get to do for a living is the fact that I get to collaborate in such an incredible way with writers and directors and cast members and crew members, you know, it, it just really, the teamwork of it is what I love. And so that was really heightened on this. And, you know, I've, I've never been a part of something that got 20 Emmy nominations. And I, it feels so right and I'm so happy about it because I think it really honors the unusual experience that we all had and the like deep co collaboration that we all had. Most people admire people who achieve things, but you somehow look at it as if it's a personality disorder. What exactly are you getting done? We have had a cast text thread since, since we were shooting. Um, and then that has maintained, uh, you know, since beyond shooting. And um, so, yeah, the cast text thread was very celebratory that day. And, um, you know, getting an Emmy nomination is always a surprise. It's always a surprise. You always feel like, oh my gosh, I cannot believe this. This is like incredible, too good to be true. Um, but then having the experience of sharing the category with four of my cast members who I love and respect so much, and then like three of the guys are in the you know male category. It was just like, this is this is really magical. Well, I mean, there are so many things that made the shoot special. Um, you know, the fact that it was in the middle, or actually at the beginning, at the most scary point of a worldwide pandemic, you could consider that special, um, and. You know, but then of course, the fact that we got to shoot at this amazing, gorgeous hotel in Maui, um, which was closed down when we first started shooting there. So that was kind of just, I mean, who gets that opportunity? Um, and, you know, but then beyond that, you know what made it special? A fantastic script, a fantastic cast and crew being able to bond with everybody like so closely because we were all really in this very intense bubble. And there was something about, we'd all been in quarantine. Everybody had been in isolation. At, by the time we started shooting, the world had been shut down for like six months. So there was something about coming back into a world where you were with other humans, doing the thing that you love, you know, that was really special. Why is your bed in here? Olivia said I have to sleep here. I just don't think it's fair for your brother to have to spend his entire vacation in a windowless box. Why not? You got to bring a friend. And I'm so appreciative, Nicole. The thing that I think we all felt was the most kind of sacred about it was we would, if we, if we wrapped in time, um, we would always head down to the beach because we couldn't leave the hotel, but there was a beach attached to the hotel and we could go to that beach. And it was so gorgeous and the sunsets were just magnificent. So if we wrapped in time, it was always the goal. It's like, let's meet down at the beach and watch the sunset and we would wade out into the water and just have this like really ethereal experience and it was so wonderful.